Hello, welcome to my shed. I like to spend most of my days in here and I love to build pre-war motorcycles. Uh, the machines I'm most passionate about are actually non-specific, but the machines that you can't obtain any parts for, because I love nothing more than shaping pieces of metal into unobtainable motorcycle bits. In front of us here we've got a set of lugs to create a frame for 1928 S100 Bruff and I've machined all of those from rough castings. Rough castings really do start off quite rough, they're in a nice old malleable cast iron. These for the Bruff I get from my friend Mark up in Rhodes Bruff. Uh, and then you basically, by way of milling machine, drills, lathes, a little bit of grinder, shape them up, fettle them up, machine all the tube ways. It's a quite close tolerance, I like about four or five thou clearance on mine, because I actually use uh, silver solder to brace them together, rather than braze, because the braze is a higher temperature and the cast iron doesn't like it so much. So they've got to be close to fit to get the strength. But there's probably about 400 hours worth of work already into this table full of parts. Yeah, it's really quite a slow old job, but incredibly rewarding. Especially when you think, I mean, the Bonneville land speed record builder I bought, I built in here, started off like this as well. So it's, it's really nice, it's funny actually when you start with just a pile of rusty lugs. Uh, that's something that came out of a box of old sand. And then, you know, two years later you end up seeing that thing fly across the salt. This is, this is going to be a road bike, but a similar machine. But, yeah, I'm going to sweat it all up, I'm going to set it up on this jig table slot it all together, just thought it would be nice for you to have a look. 